Talking Terps with Kelly Perks coming to you with another review. This time we got from Budco, the Budsy, the portable water bottle, bong. And I'm going to tell you straight up the number one bad thing about this it leaks. Now, the so number two. But there's a air hole. You just flip it. Get your ball. I already tested it out. All you need to do, just move that ball to the second one. And bam, it's ready. All right, number two, it's plastic. So you're gonna have to be cleaning it daily for the smell. It's supposed to be an incognito bomb made for stealthy hits but honestly this is more the hype is not real for this one it's more of a novelty like it's gonna come in handy but when someone grabs it gets in their hand and they smell it yeah it's gonna be noticeable but you fill it up to right here 420 milliliters just right above this one I believe no one has done reviews on this one so I had to do this review but anyways I'm gonna load it up show you guys how to how it hits but I'll be back and I also got some pink runs right here I'm gonna pack this package 513 2021 Total cannabinoids 33.7%, total TUC 27.74, total terpenes, that's what I like to see in weed, where it says the terpenes 1.57% from runs. But yeah, about to break one nug down. It smells like forbidden fruit. Crazy. Like tangy. But I'll be back and pack it so you guys can see how it hits. Alright fam, and we are back. As you can see, I packed a little snapper. Not a lot, but just enough so you guys can see the busky in action. Got my hemp wick, got my toker poker. Let's get this. Hope everyone's blazing right now. But cheers. I honestly don't feel like it's that airtight. I feel like it could have been more potentially better. I'm just not comfortable hitting this for some reason. But I am getting good hit. But yeah, it's more like of a hype. I preferably don't like it. But who knows? Maybe it won't smell. Gotta be cleaning it daily. But for anyone who doesn't know, think be a water bottle. But like I said, it's not airtight. So if you put it on the side, it's bound to freaking spill. Then also, you could technically, this is a size 14 millimeter right here. You could fit a quartz snail and take a dab out of this. Or you could just fit a traditional 
weed bowl and get like a bigger tope that's one good thing on the butt seat but other than that like I said it's being sold for what it isn't I mean it is a cool like low key looking once you you know disassemble it put it back to normal but like I said it's not even spill proof so it's gonna be freaking spill and this is meant for two to on the go on the go tubes but yeah I'll pass on this one but I had to do this review so you guys could check it out maybe you guys like it but me I don't like it but thank you guys for checking out this review don't forget to subscribe like and share and comment on the video down below thank you guys for watching peace